let us learn about word processing. Word processing is the creation, editing, and printing of document using a computer program called word processor. In word processing, you do not only make simple documents, but it also allows you to create great-looking documents enhanced by colorful, big text, graphics, pictures, or photos as well. One of the most famous word processing program is Pages. Pages is a part of iWork productivity package developed by Apple Company. Pages is an easy-to-use word processing application that allows users to quickly create great-looking documents. Getting started with Pages. If you want to open the Pages program, all you have to do is double-click the Pages icon from the dock. It will open the Template Chooser. Template Chooser has two categories. The word processing and the other one, the page layout. If you want to write text or document is starting from the scratch, then you can work on word processing. Then you choose blank. The blank has two page set up, the portrait and landscape. If you choose portrait, the setup of the document will be in vertical position. Then if you choose landscape, the page setup of the document is in horizontal position. Working with the window of pages. When you start working with a blank document, you will have your writing area. On the writing area, you will see a small vertical line that blinks. That is what we call cursor. The cursor indicates to where the text will be placed as you begin to type. Example, the cursor is there. That means that the text that you have to type will begin on that portion. When you type text in a word processing program, you will just type the text continuously and you will observe that the text moves on the next line every time it reaches the right margin. That is a feature of word processing known as word wrapping or word wrap. This portion is a ruler line. This controls the margins and tops of your document. This is a format bar. It contains commands that you can use to edit or modify your text. This is a toolbar. Toolbar is a convenient way for you to execute some of the commands while creating your document. This is a menu bar. A menu bar has sets of menus and each menu contains list of commands. If you want to select a command from a menu, you can use your mouse by clicking or selecting the command, or you can choose the command or execute the command using keyboard shortcut keys. For example, if you want to change the view of your document, the usual thing that you will do is to go to view menu, choose zoom, and choose zoom in. But you can also execute the command by just simply doing the keyboard shortcut for zoom in, which is pressing the command key and the greater than symbol key on your keyboard. Then it will automatically zoom in the view of your document. You can also change the view of your document into fit with or into fit page. The shortcut button for you to change the viewing of your document is by clicking 
this viewing button and then you may choose the scaling percentage of the view of your document. Now let us learn how to save the created document. Once you're done creating your document, you are now ready to save it. Go to File menu and choose the command Save. Or you can use the keyboard shortcut for saving by just pressing the command key and letter S on your keyboard. Or you can choose the command Save As or use the keyboard shortcut for Save As by pressing the Shift key and Command key and S on your keyboard. Save As dialog box will appear on your screen, but make sure you have to select the Grade Level folder and your Sections folder. Then in the file name box, type the correct file name and click the Save button. Now, get ready to create your document in Pages.